This tutorial is designed to help you, the designer, elevate your model presentation by creating realistic visuals that clearly show clients what their project will look like. Using a few simple yet powerful tools, you'll learn how to complete a high-quality 3D rendering without needing to export your model. In this example, not only is the house design complete, but the landscaping has also been fully developed to create a rich and realistic final image. We will begin with lighting options which can be accessed by selecting Options, Mode Options. For optimal results, ensure you're using a video card that supports DirectX 12. A list of recommended cards is available on our website. Next, go to the Lighting tab. Here we can see that lighting is enabled. A brief explanation of the options available include Auto light sources. This will artificially light all surfaces. Typically this results in flattening the image and usually is only in play when setting up a scene. Ambient lighting. This adjusts the overall brightness of your model. In most cases setting it to 0 or 1 allows for better control of lighting through items such as sun position, time of day, and manually placed light sources. The headlight is an artificial light which is attached to the camera. While it doesn't cast shadows, it can be useful to brighten your immediate view. Tone mapping enhances the appearance of textures by adjusting brightness and contrast, making surfaces look more natural and detailed. Enabling shadows in ray trace mode allows objects to cast realistic shadows based on your chosen light sources. Electrical symbols can automatically emit light when placed in your model. These can be customized under the light tab by enabling the custom option. Here you can adjust the brightness, lumens, and color temperature. Use repeat edit to apply these settings to similar light fixtures across the model. Another major source of light in exterior 3D renderings comes from adjusting the sun options. Here you can modify the time zone, date, and time of day to simulate different lighting conditions. You can also adjust the illuminance to control the overall brightness of the scene. The stone texture currently applied to the exterior can be refined through surface edit. Under the lighting tab, Roughness controls how smooth or textured the surface appears. The higher the value, the rougher the look. Relief depth adds the illusion of surface indentations, enhancing depth and realism. For relief depth to take effect, it must be enabled under Mode Options, Face Options. If reflections are also enabled, reflective surfaces like window glazing will realistically mirror the surrounding elements. To further enhance depth, using profiles is key. For example, right-click and edit the roof, then select a profile such as asphalt shingles under the roof material. In a similar way, editing the dormer siding wall will reveal the assigned profile from the wall definition. Once those elements are configured, open the mode options and enable path tracing. This setting simulates how light rays bounce and interact in a scene. Increasing the number of passes improves image quality. Higher values for indirect bounces enhance shadow detail and realism. As shown here, using 10,000 passes rendered in approximately two and a half minutes produces a high quality exterior image. In this next example, we'll move inside a different model to explore SoftPlan's ray tracing capabilities. Begin again by selecting Options, Mode Options, where you can adjust ambient light and headlight settings. As mentioned earlier, placing true light fixtures will create more realistic shadows and lighting effects. Ensure that tone mapping and shadows are enabled and configured. Under Face Options, enable Relief Depth and Reflections. 
With reflections active, any surface with a reflectivity value, such as a glass table or refrigerator, will contribute to a more immersive and dynamic image. Using Surface Edit, under the Lighting tab, you'll find the Metalness setting. The higher the value, the more metallic the surface will appear. To apply a surface's appearance elsewhere, use Surface Copy and Paste, for example, from the refrigerator to the range hood. As mentioned earlier, you can also adjust light fixtures. Under the Light tab, enable the Custom option. Adjust Brightness, Lumens, and Color Temperature to create a warmer or cooler lighting effect. Using PBR textures such as leather adds realism and material accuracy to the scene. To remove harsh white spots from light sources, try softening them by increasing the roughness value of the affected surface. Finally, enable path tracing again under the Options, Mode Options, Lighting and set the desired number of passes to render a realistic, high-quality interior image.